solution of quadratic equation by graphical method you know that there are different methods are there to solve the quadratic equation or to find the roots of the quadratic equation here the graphical method is also one of the method to find the roots of the quadratic equation to find the roots of the equation by graphical method first find the coordinates of this equation how to find the coordinates first give the values for x 0 1 minus 1 like that we will get the value of y so there is a one confusion is there how many values you need to find here here one shortcut is there we can find how many values you need to find so you know that by splitting the middle term method we can find the roots of this equation you multiply these two x square minus 2 minus 2 x square if you multiply two numbers you need to get minus 2 x square and you need that numbers as to be subtract or odd you need to get minus x which are those number so you can write 2 1 so here minus is there you put minus you need to subtract then only you will get a minus x therefore I will give x here this is also x this for plus see minus into plus minus 2 ones are 2 x into x x square the values are like this so here minus 2 is there then x has to become plus 2 then x has to become minus 1 then we need to find the value up to 2 and minus 1 or more than that also this is the Mm, values will get by graph so now I am going to take the values for x is 0 1 minus 1 2 minus 2 see this is enough minus 1 minus uh, plus 2 is enough but I will take more than that also there is no problem or you can stop here 3 and minus 3 give these values to x and you will get y value you can directly give 0 uh, square is 0 and x uh, in place of x you substitute 0 0 means 0 minus 2 the value you will get 0 minus 0 minus 2 is minus 2 or we can substitute the values x is equal to 0 to this equation y is equal to x square minus x minus 2 if you substitute 0 to this equation y is equal to 0 square minus 0 minus 2 you will get 0 0 0 will remaining is minus 2 if you give the x value 0 to this equation you will get minus 2 so similarly you give x is equal to 1 x is equal to 1 you substitute in this equation this equation y is equal to in place of x square is substitute 1 square minus in place of x 1 minus 2 we will get 1 square is 1 minus 1 minus 2 see minus 1 plus 1 cancel you will get minus 2 similarly substitute we find the value for x is equal to minus 1 y is equal to minus in place of x square you substitute minus 1 whole square minus in place of x substitute minus 1 minus 2 right as it is see simplify 1 square minus 1 square is plus 1 minus into minus plus 1 minus 2 see these two are plus plus 1 plus 1 is plus 2 plus 2 minus 2 is 0 so like that we can find uh, for the value for 2 if you give x is equal to 2 y becomes y is equal to so x square x square means 2 square minus in place of x substitute 2 minus 2 as it is here this is 2 square is 4 minus 2 and minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 is minus 4 plus 4 is 0 if you give x is equal to minus 2 what is the answer you are going to get y is equal to in plus of x you substitute minus 2 minus 2 whole square minus of minus 2 minus 2 get minus 2 square is 4 
minus into minus plus 2 we are minus 2 plus 2 minus 2 get cancelled the value is 4 then again you find the value of if you give value 3 x is equal to 3 x is equal to 3 you will get y is equal to so value is x square in place of x square substitute 3 square minus in place of x 3 and minus 2 3 square is Muru square is equal to Mumbatu minus Muru minus Yeradu. Mumbatu minus Muru minus Yeradu minus Aidu. Subtract, you will get 4. Similarly, substitute x is equal to minus 3. You will get y is equal to in place of x square, substitute minus 3 minus 3 square minus of minus 3 in place of x minus 3 and minus 2 minus 3 is 9 minus into minus plus 3 and minus 2 you hard these two will get 12 12 minus 2 is 10 now substitute uh, these values, y values, uh, write down the y values in this column. So if you give x is equal to 0, you got minus 2. If you substituted x is equal to 1, you got the minus 2 value. If you substitute minus 1, you got the value is 0, y value is 0. If you substitute x is equal to 2, you got uh, the value is uh, 0 again. So if you substitute minus 2, got value is 4 if you substitute minus uh, plus 3 got uh, 4 and I substitute minus 3 is 10 now these coordinates we write to x comma y coordinates that is 0 comma minus 2 and 1 comma minus 2 minus 1 comma 0 we are 2 comma 0 and minus 2 comma 4 3 comma 4 and minus 3 comma 10 these are the coordinates these coordinates can be represented in graph now we can represent these values on the graph but in the time of finding these values no need to write all those things if you are uh, Difficult to write uh, directly this answer if you substitute 0, 0 square is 0, minus x, uh, x uh, plus 0, completely 0, you will get minus 2. Or substitute 1, 1 square is 1, minus 1, plus 1, minus get cancel, minus 2. Like that you can write directly. Or if you are difficult to uh, write like that, we can find like this. Okay. So now we can substitute uh, this, represent these coordinates on the graph, then we will get the uh, roots of the equation then see how to represent on the graph now we can represent these coordinates in this graph so I have written here x axis and y axis so from 0 to right side all are plus values from each 1 on centimeter I represented this and 1 on centimeter I given 1 2 3 4 5 etc so here we go left side so minus 1 minus 2 if you go upside the y axis, so plus 1, plus 2, plus 3, if you come down, minus 1, minus 2. Represent this. Now I am going to represent these coordinates on the graph. See here the first coordinate is 0, comma, minus 2. The first one is, this 0 is x coordinate and uh, y e, uh, minus 2 is y, y coordinate. You can represent these coordinates on the graph. 0 is in x 0 is this y is equal to minus 2 in y axis minus 2 is down uh, this is 0 comma 0 comma minus 2 this point next we can represent 1 comma minus 2 in x axis 1 is this minus 2 is y axis is this 1 comma this 1 comma minus 2 
Next minus 1 comma 0. Minus 1 in x axis is this. This one and 0 y axis 0 is this. This point is called minus 1 comma 0. Next is 2 comma 0. 2 comma 0. In axis 2 is this. 0 is also this. This is 2 comma 0. Next one is minus 2 comma 4. Minus 2 is this. And 4 you go upside. Minus 2 x axis minus 2 is this. 4 is if you go 1, 2, 3 and 4. This is. This one is minus 2 comma 4. Next is minus 2 comma minus 4 is over. Uh, 2 comma 0 is also over. Next is 3 comma 4. Where is 3 comma 4? 3 is this and 4. So 1, 2, 3 and 4. This is. 3 comma 4. Next is minus 3 comma 10. Minus 3 in x axis is this and 10 is if you go up to the top this is 10. This is minus 3 comma 10. Now join all the points. You join these two and uh, join these two. I'll put scale and I'll join these two values. Also, I'm going to join these two. I'll join these two. These two. And these two points. See, this parabola, this is called as parabola this parabola is intercepted on x axis that means intersect at x at two different point that is so one is at two plus two and another one is minus one this is plus two and minus one these two are the roots of the quadratic equation the x value is one x is equal to minus one and x is equal to the roots of the equations are the roots of the equations equations are x is equal to minus 1 and x is equal to 2. These are the roots of the given quadratic equation. Should write scale for this scale in x and y axis I take on 1 centimeter is equal to 1 unit 1 centimeter is equal to 1 unit so this this is for 4 mars question so if you write this we will get off mars and if you write this we will get a uh, one and of mars and the for the table you will get two mars totally four mars you are going to take thank you